Burley so. All right, hello everybody and welcome back to Burley So. I'm your host Purified and today we've got another embroidery design for the Brother Machines. This one's going to be a Christmas stocking and I've got a special guest in the studio today to help me out and I'll introduce her in a second. But just to show you on the machine itself, um, as usual, you've got your canned or pre-programmed designs right here. Once you've got the carriage hooked up to your machine and you can page through it and this one's number 31. So we'll page over to number 31 and we've done a few of these in the past but this one right here it's a cute little Christmas stocking just in time for the holidays. So that's the one that we're going to choose. You can see that it's a five step design and it uses a few different colors red oops gotta go into color check here you can page over and we've got red for the first part moss green light blue flesh pink and harvest gold so now that we've seen those let's take a look and see what the colors actually look like and this is where I'm gonna introduce my special guest so here's my special guest everybody, Gabby. This is my daughter. Say hello. Hello. Do you have anything that you want to say to the fine people out there in YouTube land? Um, I love Burley So. <laughs> what a great endorsement. Mm -hmm. Alright, so we saw the colors on the machine, right? Mm -hmm. So let's take a look at the colors and see what they look like. So uh, the first color is what color? Red. Okay, and why don't you show the folks the red? All right, and there's our red. And um, some of these colors have numbers attached to them. Um, this one happens to be 800, right? Yes. And uh, that's exactly the color that we're using is a suggested 800 color red. So what's the next color, Gabby? Moss green. Okay, and show us what that one looks like. Okay, moss green. And that one, the color is 515. Yes. Okay. And for step three, what's our color? Light blue. Okay. And there's the light blue. It's a pretty blue. And that one is numbered 17. And we've got two more colors to go. What's the next one? Flesh pink. Flesh pink. So that one's very pretty. That one's number 124. And then the last one... We're not really sure about, but... Yeah, we're not really sure. The, the, the design calls for number 206, and that's a Harvest Gold. I believe this is Harvest Gold. I just lost the sticker on it, but why don't you show them what we're going to use. All right, so there's our Harvest Gold, and that's going to end up being like the trumpet. Um, so, and as always, you don't always use, need to use the colors that yeah. they ask for, right? You can substitute your own colors if you want. Um, but we think these colors are going to work pretty good that they recommended, and we're just going to use what we think to be the correct color for the last one. Mm -hmm. All right, so um, what should we do now? So the embroidery? Yeah, let's do the embroidery <laughs> design.
All right, so we're done, and uh, that's our design. It looks like it has a lot of jump stitches that we need to trim up. Mm -hmm. So let's go ahead and trim up those jump stitches, and we'll see what our final product looks like. Sound good? Mm-hmm. Okie doke. Okay, and that's what our design looks like. Yeah, it's pretty cute, right? Yes. Yeah, I think um, it turned out a lot better than I thought. I mean, obviously, when you page through them on the machine, you can't get a good idea what they look like, and... I didn't have any other real reference of, of what it would look like when it's done. So I think it turned out really cute. I think it would be good for maybe if you did, if you had Christmas napkins mm -hmm. or if you um, made some like Christmas towels that you decor decorative to Christmas mm -hmm. towels for your kitchen. I want to thank my guest Gabby for helping me out with this project. Thank you very much, Gabby. You're welcome. And as I, always, everybody, thanks for watching Burley So If you haven't subscribed yet, please do. Um, if you have any comments, please leave those below. And always, thanks for watching. Burly so.